Hey, what's going on guys? Plus 2 is problem right here. The question is asking two very large parallel sheets a distance d apart have their centers directly opposite to each other. The sheets carry equal but opposite uniform surface charge densities. A point charge that is placed near the middle of the sheet is distance d by 2 from each of them will an electric field of F due to the sheets. If this charge is now moved closer to one of the sheets, so that is it is a distance d by 4 from that sheet, what will we what will what force will feel? So we have initially we had d by 2 distance and then we had d by 4 distance and they are asking for the change in force. So if you notice that uh, for a uh, electric for field inside a plate, we can calculate the electric field using this formula E is equal to this one sigma over epsilon naught, right? So this is the equation to calculate the electric field. Here the sigma is a sigma is surface charge density. So surface charge surface charge density charge density right so this is the sigma and if you notice there is nothing related to distance right here so it means this is this electric field is independent of the distance so the force is not going to change so the final answer is going to be it's also going to be f because uh, distance has no effect on the force so therefore the force is going to be f and let's do the next part the question is asking a dipole consists of charges plus or minus 5 micro coulomb separated by 1.2 millimeter. It's, it is placed in a vertical electric field of magnitude 525 newton per coulomb oriented as the picture shown. The magnitude of the net torque this field exerts on the dipole is close to which value. So they are asking for the torque. So whenever we have electric field um, the magnitude of torque in a dipole system if you notice it's a dipole system right equal charges and opposite uh, equal, I mean e equal values and opposite charges so it means it's a dipole and whenever we have something that also they have mentioned right here dipole so whenever we have this situation we can use torque equation that is QD E sin phi. So here Q is the charge that is going to be 5 and D is the separated distance that's 1.2 millimeter and E is electric field that's provided by 25 newton per coulomb and sin phi is the angle that's making with this one. So that's 140 they have provided. So we can apply everything and find the final value. So let's apply everything. Q is uh, 5 micro coulomb so 5 times 10 to the power of minus 6 coulomb times the distance is 1.2 millimeter so 1.2 times 10 to the power of minus 3 times uh, E that is electric field 525 newton per coulomb this is meter and 525 newton per coulomb and then sine phi sine 140 degree and if you calculate this value you will get 0 0.000 Zero, zero, 002 newton meter and if you want to they have given answer in scientific notation so you will get if you convert this one into scientific notation you will get 2.02 .02 times 10 to the power of minus 6 newton meter and that is the answer and here if you want to choose or uh, this one matches with this answer therefore the answer for this one is this one 2.02 times 10 to the power of minus 6 newton meter and that's how we do these kind of problems i hope you guys find this helpful see you next time